Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Printing Iceland. In this episode of Makerbox Mondays, I'm going to have a look at a filament from Polyalchemy called Elixir Gold. Um, let's have a look after the intro. So this filament is from Polyalchemy called Elixir Gold. Uh, it's really shiny gold color filament. And here they say that you should print at 200 to 220 degrees at the room temperature to 55 degrees on the bed. Um, they say it's a custom PLA blend uh, pr produced like satin like surface finish and um, adjust temperature to get best surface finish. Um, this is from Polyalchemy. So, looking at the prints, uh, they came out excellent. Um, one thing to note, uh, layer adhesion is not very good and this broke off when I was trying to remove this from the bed and I had that issue with all the maker coins I printed but this filament is first and foremost a filament that looks awesome, it's not a mechanical filament so don't expect it to be a strong filament but the look of it is excellent and it's really easy to print with, no no issues, like no stringing or no issues uh, in this print I did. So the maker coins are looking awesome. Um, you see the shine to it and layers blend really well and it's like a silk finish as I state. Uh, the letters came out excellent and the logo on the back and you can see the shine. It's <laughs> really, really crazy good looking. And I printed Mr. Belly here and it came out excellent and no issues, no stringing. Sometimes get stringing here in this part, but not with this filament, no issues. So this was looking awesome. And it's truly like a gold <laughs> plated <laughs> object. It shines very nice. And here's the uh, Omnum by Tessa and that is looking awesome. It's the uh, best looking Omnum <laughs> I've done, I think. It's crazy good looking. Um, I was getting really good results with this filament. Um, here's an Otis model by Gareth. Um, this was also looking excellent and no stringing issues and just awesome print. And I've done a full review of this filament on my channel that you can have a look at. But overall this filament was giving me excellent results. No issues printing and just that layer addition is not good so you have to watch out for that. But for for shiny objects like the maker coins and the artists and Omnum, it was looking awesome and, and uh, no issues in regard of printing. Just have to use the recommended temperature and as I say, the, the shine of the filament changes a little bit depending on temperature, so you can play around with that depending on what you want to get out of it. But other than that, it was a really good filament. So for this quick look in the makeup box samples for the Elixir Gold from Polyalchemy, this will be it. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.